All right, we're back. So these things are getting looking good. Let's take a quick peek. I know you're not supposed to do this, but take, take a look at this. Oh my God, look at those. So a couple of things I need to clarify. There's like a 50 to 90% chance I use self-rising flour on accident, so keep that in mind. So it's like a double, that's why the price is so tall. So you might have probably, I mean, I know I did actually. And then uh, the actual recipe when you switch it to banana muffins is supposed to be brown sugar instead of regular sugar. So uh, yeah, I don't know. I did it wrong, obviously, but damn, they look good. We're coming up on here just a couple minutes till they're done. Um, yeah, I don't know. Who knows how this is going to turn out? I mean, they look amazing. I'm not sure. <clears throat> I'm not sure if I'm supposed to poke them with a stick or what I'm supposed to do. I mean, say cook them for 20 to 25 minutes, and they've been in for 20. So I figure I'll cook them for 22 minutes. I mean, can you go wrong at 22 minutes? I'll be using the uh, the old silicone uh, muffin grabbers. In classic black and red, because why would you want a matching set of gloves when you can have mismatch sets? But uh, yeah, I mean, two more minutes, but I don't really want to wait two more minutes, but I kind of feel like I need to. So, I don't know. We'll have to see. We'll have to see how this goes. The old banana muffin experiment of 2020. I feel like doing the old toothpick test. What do you think? Should we do it? It's down to a minute. Let's try it. Go in right there. Try to get to the dead center. Ooh, a little bit sticking still. See? Can you get that on there? It's still sticking a little bit. So we need. We're, we might need that full 25. Because uh, like, uh, yeah, 25. They were starting to brown up a little bit, but it's hard to tell because of that. Uh, Sprinkle on top, you know, the sprinkle is brown, but man, I'm sure it gets easier after you do a couple batches. I don't know if I've ever cooked a muffin in my life, to be honest with you. Think about just eating the tops, eat the tops, throw the stumps away. Ha <laughs> ha! That's a classic, classic stump eater. But yeah. Yeah, I think I filled them just about right. So that was about a quarter to the top is what I did. I ended up like adjusting them all, but if you didn't notice. So let's let's put a couple let's put a couple more minutes on here. Let's do. Try to, I've changed the timer so many times I gotta do the math in my head, so it was like let's do three more minutes. Yeah, we'll do three more minutes. I don't know what happens if they're raw on the inside. You get some sort of banana complex. Banana bread brain. Um, don't know. So for those of you that watch this video in the future, right now is the COVID-19 uh, meltdown going on. So there's no toilet paper. They were out of eggs and milk and bread for a while. Uh, hand sanitizer is hard to come by. Clorox wipes don't exist anymore. Um, bleach is hard to find. Yep, so good luck. Banana muffins it is. It's actually, some of that stuff's coming back. I heard the stores had food again. It just there was a couple weeks ago there was a Pretty big surge. God, I want to look at this. It looks like it's starting to burn. Oh, those are done! Those muffins are done! Clear that out. Right, here we go. So we're going to try to zoom this back a little bit. The, the live action shot of me probably dropping muffins onto the floor, if I had to guess. So let's see how this works. Glove up! I don't know how, I don't know, if they, hopefully they just pop right out. Wouldn't that be great? Like a tool. Grab. Slide. Okay, 
so I need to get those onto the rack. But where am I going to put that? I don't want to burn. Let's do this. Let's do this. That's a silicone trivet. We'll put that down. And we'll put the muffin pan rack thing on the trivet. Ooh, those guys got a little bit sideways. You see that? Hold on. Look at that. They got a little sideways on their on their exponential growth. Let's see what happens here. I don't know how to. These pop out. What can I do? Just pop out. They might need a little bit longer. They're a little a little under, maybe on the sides. Oh, I don't know what to do. I feel like I'm committed. Yeah, I feel like I'm committed here. I mean, it's weird. The bottom's cooked well. Maybe maybe because it was on that tray, the air didn't circulate around good enough. Well, hold on a second. Now, think logically. Normally, there's paper around a muffin. When you peel the paper off, it's kind of a raw muffin edge. So maybe that's how they're supposed to be. Mm. It's a tough one. I mean, it's got good color on the bottom. So, yep. Probably let that cool off for a second before I refill. I mean, you think I need to wash that? Like a... Yeah, I don't know. So, yeah. Let's get these gloves off. Break one of these bad boys open. Oh, that's hot. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! Hot muffin! God damn, I'm going into business, son. Muffin pie! Woo, yeah! Huh, those are amazing. Two thumbs up. Yeah, that's a wrap. Enjoy your muffins.